let's welcome Steffi Becker from Houston, Texas. Pat Diamond from Wayne, New Jersey. And Midge Dexter from Akron, Ohio. Uh, Jimmy, how do you read this putt? Well, this putt of Midge Dexter's uh, should be about 15 feet, breaking sharply to the left. Yeah, Midge has not had a good day putting. You know, after bogeys at 10 and 12, and then that disastrous triple at 16, Midge really could use this one. Tap in bogey, Mitch Dexter's going to wind up the round with a very disappointing four over 76. And uh, Jim, I think she faces an uphill battle to make tomorrow's cut. Well, that's for sure, Chet. We'll be right back with more first round action right after this word from the Handicraft Power Tools. If I miss the cut tomorrow, I figure we can be on the road by 6 and make Phoenix in the morning. I mean, if we drive all night. Hey, we're not going anywhere, mister, because you're going to make that cut. Oh, what the hell? Maybe I'll just pack it in. Don't say that. Come on. You're one heck of a great golfer. All those others out there, they'd kill for your swing, your sand game. You've got what it takes to be the best, and if I hear one more word about quitting, I'm gonna give you a punch in the puss you won't forget. I don't deserve you, kid. Oh, come on, I'm the lucky one. I thank the good Lord every day that you came and took me out of that crummy diner in Barstow. <laughs> hey, remember? I asked you if you wanted to know what the special was. Yeah, and I said, baby, I'm hoping it's you. <laughs> Listen, I know, I know it's been a tough last couple of years, all the traveling and scrambling just to make expenses, but I swear, it's gonna get better. I know. Hey, I made you a new cover for your clubs. <laughs> Hi, my name's Charlie Chipmunk, <laughs> and I'm gonna keep your three wood all nice and warm. That's cute. You like yeah. it? <laughs> Oh, hey, hey, watch this. This guy drains it to win the whole enchilada. Great putt, huh? Wish I could do that. What? Like her. Like Mrs. Lee Jansen. I wish that, you know, when you win a tournament, I could run out onto the green and jump into your arms. Yeah, well, since my best finish was a tie for fifth at the 93 Nancy Culp Invitational, I don't think that's really a problem yet. I just don't understand why it has to be like this, you know, pretending all the time. Hey, come on, we've been through this, kiddo. You know, why can't we have a normal life? I mean, like some of our friends, you know? Robin and Angela and Audrey and Evelyn. I mean, they don't try to fool anyone. Yeah, well, they're not in the public eye like I am. Hmm? Oh, Midge, you know Kim and Roberta? Yeah. They're having a baby with the cable guy. Yeah. And why do we have to say I'm your nutritionist for all the time, for Christ's sake? You know, oh, today, somebody says to me, so, uh, Chris, you got Midge doing any carbo loading? And I said, uh, oh, no, I do all the heavy lifting. And they go, oh, that's funny. I didn't even know I was making a joke. Is that funny? Uh -huh. Listen, someday I'm going to be up there with you right next to me and tell everyone this is the one. This is my baby. If anybody doesn't like it, tough titties. Midge, you really mean that, right? You bet I do. <laughs> and what about me? Oh. <laughs> so, 
You want to stay here or you want to eat something out? <laughs> and sinks it. Poor oh. amazing 68. That's a, quite a round today for Midge Dexter. She's come from the middle of the pack from nowhere, and uh, now she's right up there amongst the leaders. And coming in at four under par, Midge Dexter. Hey, Mitch. Hey, congratulations. God, that was a great round. Oh, thanks. I got Jack Khalid. I'm the marketing VP for Master Swing. Oh, yeah. Hi. Hi. Very nice <laughs> to meet nice you. Nice meeting you. Listen, uh, if you put on the uh, winner's windbreaker tomorrow, we'd sure love to discuss some endorsement opportunities with you. Well, sure. I think I can maybe find some time for that. That's great. <laughs> right. <laughs> this is Chris Warner, my uh, nutritionist. Really? Say, tell me, what do you think about these new anabolic enzyme substitutes? Oh, uh, uh, well, I, I think they're delicious. Uh, uh, anyway, nice meeting you, Midge. Thanks. Good luck tomorrow. Oh, thanks a lot. Thanks. I can't do this anymore. I mean, I just can't do this anymore. I'm not your nutritionist. I'm your Hey, hey, hey! Come on! Sorry, Jeez. I'm sorry. I'm gonna go wait in the blazer. Hey, okay. Oh, I'm really sorry. It's my fault. It's well, my fault. I sure would okay. hate to smash into a face as pretty as that. <sighs> I'm Matt Craig. I'm uh, one of the teaching pros here. Oh, uh, I'm uh, Chris. Chris Warner. Oh, do you play? Me golf? Oh no, no. Well, I'm come good. on. What? Yeah, give it a hit. Mm. I'm gonna show you how to do this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm. Now is this okay? Yes, but any closer, and you're going to have to meet my parents. So. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here. Okay, all right. Now, okay. let me help you guide it. Take it back nice and easy. Oh, I hit it! I hit it! Well, yes, you did, and look, it went straight down the middle. Right. You lied to me. You're, you've played before, no, haven't no, you? Oh, you're my come lucky on. charm. Okay. Come on. Hello, may I take your order, please? Yeah, I'd like a double burger, everything on it. Uh, large fries, chocolate shake, two tacos, extra hot sauce. And a fish fillet for me. And a fish fillet for her. Okay. Mitch, with the tournament tomorrow, you think you should be eating so heavy? What are you, my nutritionist? So I suppose you're watching your figure after your lesson with Matt. Yeah, you know, he didn't even charge me. Oh, gee, really? So you learn anything? Yeah. <laughs> I think he taught me a thing or two. Oh, yeah? Like what? Like how to shift your weight? How to turn your hands over? Or how that maybe you really like men, huh? Mitch! How maybe you'd rather have some big hunky guy on top of you, right? Uh, Rancher Cajun on that fellow. That doesn't even deserve a response. Okay, right. Well, I'm telling you something, all right? You just better stay away from that guy. Oh, so that's how it is, right? Just stay away. So let's get this straight, okay? Like, you don't want me being with anyone else, but you don't want anybody knowing that you're with me. Oh, well, it's no good anymore. Hey, right? hey, hey! hey. Hey! Oh, what's the matter? Uh -huh. You're afraid people will know that we're together? Oh, and so I'm not with her, everybody. We're not together. I'm not with Mitch Dexter, professional golfer. An extra large gets you a cloudy cup. Shut the fuck up! Hey, come on. Take it easy. Hey, you got a problem, buddy? Come on. Excuse hey, me. Well, all right, I, I don't blame you for being uh, for being hello? upset, okay? I've been a real shit. Don't all right, swear. Honey, it's, it's going to be different, I promise. Look, I'm going to win that tournament tomorrow. And when I do, I'm going to make everything right, because without you, I'm nothing, baby. Who knows? I'm glad you think that way, Mitch. Because you know what I'm going to do when you win tomorrow? No, what are you going to do? I'm going to run out of the crowd, and I'm going to run across that green, oh, and I'm going to jump oh, into your geez. arms, and everybody on God's green earth is going to know who and what we are. <sighs> All right! Come on, come on. I'm coming. Ladies, Sorry. would you please pull up to the window? Oh, You're holding up traffic.
certainly been a topsy-turvy day for Midge Dexter. <laughs> to put it mildly, Chet. Now, she started the day at the two behind Donna Mahoney, then she took the lead at 12, she lost it again with that bogey at 14, and then tied Mahoney with that incredible chip-in on 17. Now, here at 18, it's come down to these two putts. Mahoney for the win. Oh, that was so close. She'll tap in for her par. Now, Jim, it's come down to this. This will be for the victory. Mitch Dexter's first win in 11 years on the tour. It's only about three and a half feet, but all the pressure's on. Seem to be lesbians, Jeff. Yeah. 